What's the crack lads? Welcome back to another short video. We're just going to be giving you a quick reminder on the new live update. So this is going to be the last live update for I think for a week. Um, so as you can see here that the live update is going to be oh no, we have another week of it. Sorry. So no live update is scheduled for the period shown below. The condition of all the players will be determined based on the live update rate and applied to them during the 27th to the 4th. So we won't have, this live update is going to last us two weeks. So I think it's even more important to get your squad right for the next two weeks, right? So if you go into my game game plan here, you're going to see Don is down, uh, De Bruyne is down. The rest of my squad is fairly okay. Trent, Rudiger, uh, obviously Neymar and, and Rashford and the Legends and the... Uh, uh, special players are going to be locked on B, um, but the rest of the players that I have here, Tommy Asu, we can be able to get him in as well, but the rest of my players, there's going to be a lot on A's and B's and C's, so we just need to be, you know, kind of like figuring out what players we want to go in, so um, firstly, we're going to take a look at who's on the market, and then I'll show you kind of like why I would play the players that I'm going to play, right, so you can do this both ways, lads, the quickest way I usually do it is on eFootballDB, just click on the players from the nav uh, bar above, click on filters, click on A here, exit out of that, and then that gives you all the players, it gives you the price, gives you everything that you could possibly want very, very quickly. So you've got Salah, Mbappe, Cancelo, uh, Mane, Ter Stegen, Fabinho, Lautaro, Martinez, and this applies to all the special edition of the cards as well. So if you've got player of the week, Odegaard, he's going to be on A form, Jota is going to be on A form, Koundé, any version of the card that you have, Apart from, apart from some very rare instances, all the players that you see here, any version of their card will be on A form. So the likes of Declan Rice that they released a couple of weeks back, that's going to be a huge one for me when we actually go in and have a look at my squad, right? The second way you can do it, especially if you are a newcomer, the second way you can do it is if you go back out here to your actual standard player list and go to contract, go to standard player list. We're going to press square and we're going to sort by price. It's already done for me. And then we're also going to press triangle or else Y on the Xbox. And we're going to go to live update rating and we're going to click A. Once we do that, we're going to get all the players on A form. So it's the same thing as I just showed you there on eFootball DB. All of these players here that you see are going to be repeated on that, as you see there, right? So we've got a, ni a nice blend of players. Now, for me, I would say recommending you can still use B players as well. Obviously, you know, B players are not going to be as uh, much of a chance of being up. But you do have Messi in there. You also have Courtois. You've got Van Dijk. You've got Kimmich. You've got Harry Kane. You've got Vinny Jr. So there's a lot of good players here that we'll be able to choose from um, if you want to build a squad. So just make sure that you have your team right. I know a lot of people that watch me sometimes um, forget. And I forget. I've often, you know, started a division match when I'm streaming and I'll be like, oh my God, I've got a player on D form or my goalkeeper is on C form and then he's down. And it just sets off the stream to a bad one. So, um, you know, once you get a bad run of results, it's kind of hard to turn it around. So for me, obviously then as well, once you have players in, and this is especially for newcomers, if you go into your reserves here, you can sort this and filter this even more uh, easily now when they've added this. And you can just do A's and B's for the live update rating. Go into that and that'll show you all the players on A and B form. And then obviously you can sort it however you want. You can sort it by overall rating. You can sort it whatever way you want. Obviously all your players, your special players are going to be locked on B anyway. Like this version of Messi, his standard card might be on an A. Um, but the other version of him will only always be on a on a on a B, right? Sometimes they they match up, um, but it just depends on the card, right? So for example here, I'm probably going to pop in Declan Rice. I've got two versions of Declan Rice. I'm probably going to pop in this version of him, um, because or sorry, this version of him because of the way I trained him up, and I'm probably going to use him as my DMF backup and my CB backup. So when we take a look at the bench here, we do have uh, Gabby Jesus on the bench that's on C form. I'll probably get rid of him. I'm probably going to keep Haaland on because I do have, actually, I'll probably take Haaland off let's on C form. He's probably not worth popping in. Um, this is going to be my try hard live stream kind of, um, uh, you know, like match or setup or team. Um, so I do want to kind of have it fairly balanced. Um, so I'll probably put in, you know, more kind of players that I know I'm going to be using more often than not. So for example, we could put in Ito in here. And then also on top of that, we're going to take off Kevin De Bruyne. We're going to leave our two boys up front, but we'll probably bring in Messi in here and then take off De Bruyne. Now we have cover everywhere else except goalkeeper. So that's going to be another area that I look at, but I do have a lot of cover here. I've got right back cover with Kimi. I've got center back cover with Declan Rice and Van Dijk. I've got DMF cover and CMF cover with Kimi and Declan Rice. 
And that's kind of what it's all about. So for here, I'm probably going to bring on another kind of like specialized player um, if you want to do that. And I would definitely recommend to have, depending on your formation, I would definitely recommend to have a good goalkeeper on that has got A form. And then maybe Cancelo, I will probably use him as well as my last option. So that would kind of be where I'd go with it. Um, I do have a lot of good players on the team there. I'll just take off um, uh, Courtois there. I'll, I'll put Courtois in there and then we have Kinsella who's on a form that he'll just slot in there ahead of Trent so we're just trying to keep everything as you know as as uh, as clever as possible and have the players that are going to be on b form all the time King Collar is up front obviously we can mix and match with Romario or Mbappe or whoever we want to put in there any player that's down a little bit we can replace and any player that's up we're going to be able to give them you know a starting position so um yeah that's it for me lads I'll be back soon Hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to swap out your players and let me know your favorite players to use for this week. Peace.